Hi okay, everyone, Paul Daniels here. Uh, I'm just going to show a couple of little new features that I'm putting into the future Flex board view. And um, this is something that I've been trying to put in for a little while now, but uh, yeah, time's just been getting away. Uh, let's uh, get things started here. We start the standard screen, and there's a new menu here now called Jobs. Now the idea behind this, I'll launch this one up is that um, if you're working on a particular board, a particular job, then you already have like a board loaded up, uh, say in this case, A20, 34, and you create a new job. Let's see, we'll just have a look at the current one. <clears throat> Put in all the details that you want. Let's see, we'll just, just magically died, right. And, then you can go along and as you progressively do work on the board, you can add in certain attributes like, uh, let's see, add job item, and that's it. So now when you hover over that, it tells you what you did. And you have all this list of items up here. So if you click on any particular item, it will bring it up. And if you hover over it, it will show you what was done. It's all preliminary at the moment. And you see it works in with the existing data that was always present in the info panel. And you can get an existing list of the other jobs that you've done. I'm going to make it so it's a little clearer. Uh, see, this will be a more fleshed out list. So you can see what you're looking for. And I'll have things like a uh, search facility. So you can find old jobs. At the moment, I have a feeling this is going to be perfectly acceptable for single user type situations. But I'm trying to work out the best way to go about with a multiple user situation such as say at um, Rossman Repair or anywhere where jobs are being passed between people because currently the database is being held in the personal folder but if you're going to be sharing it between multiple people you need to get that data to other people so I can make it that it's working on a shared drive and there are ways of making sure you can lock the database or the other way you can do it is that each job uh, each job is its own database. All right, well, it seems like I'm running out of voice here for some reason. Probably not enough water. But I uh, just thought I'd give that quick little update and give you guys an idea of what's yet to come.